All right guys, fresh out of the shower and I'm gonna show you a few things you can do to prep your skin so you can look summer ready. Also it can help tighten your skin too. There's a few different ways you can do it and I really believe in it. Um, if you get to this point, especially if you're prepping, sometimes it helps to use Epsom salt, but they also make a Dr. Teal's Epsom salt body scrub. Um, I had self tanner on and just got all of it off. So my skin feels super smooth, not so dry anymore. Uh, self tanners can dry you out a little bit, but this smoothing, uh, this coffee scrub here too. Smoothing coconut coffee scrub is also good. You can get any kind of body scrub really and it'll work. And Body Sands is my favorite self tanner. This actually goes on really good and it looks natural, um, especially with like how fair I am. So you can definitely tell, like I when I do events and everything, I usually will use that for myself to look more, you know, golden tan, not so pale and it really does help to pop so those three things i think are excellent you can get those on amazon pretty much everything on amazon now but uh you can get them at the Publix or wherever store you live by typically like the scrubs are easy to get the self tanners hit or miss like walgreens sells it um i got the ultra dark version because it does help to tan you quickly and i'll wash it off after six hours good morning it's day three i am um, I screwed up last night. I had Oreos last night. I had like four. <coughs> it's all that was left. And then, I, you know, now I have no snacks. So that's good. But besides that, um, I don't know what happened. I just felt like having them. And do I weigh myself every day and check that if it affected me? No. Why? Because if it did affect me, it's because I had Oreos. And that's why. And I don't care. Because I'm not trying to like subtract it or whatever from my, my daily intake today. All I have to do is just get back on my stuff and don't do Oreos again. That's how you do it. I don't like weigh myself because I know that it's always going to be something that's constantly changing. And if it's not changing, it's usually just because your body weighs a certain weight that it wants to stay at. And I've done shows and I haven't even budged from like when I started. I mean, I might have budged like six pounds, but I've gone from looking like, you know, not... I'm like kind of like off season, but not big off season to like ripped and still weighed almost the same. So I just, I know that weight is very different for everybody and there's not always going to be a number that you can reach or achieve. And I know people use it as like a gauge for their daily, you know, consumption, but I also know my body and I know what I need to pull out and what I need to like, just do whatever. And if I screw up doing Oreos, and I get bigger the next day if I was to weigh more or if I was to hold water. <coughs> Obviously, I know why. So, that's my way of th doing things. But I'm enjoying my eggs. And I'm not beating myself up over it. Because uh, I don't stress over what I eat. Cheers to uh, egg breakfast. with I do two eggs. And I do two eggs over easy. And I love that with some rye bread. Makes me happy. And coffee. I'm doing coffee now. I was doing Monster, so now I'm doing coffee. So it's better. Um, it was a bad habit. I've been doing, doing too many Monsters, so we're back. We're back. Back to coffee.